destroy. Hey, it's Bullseye Demon coming at you with another fresh Black Ops gameplay. Today I'm playing Search and Destroy on Havana. A lot of people have asked me to upload a Search and Destroy match because I'm known for Search and Destroy matches, uh, known for high KDs in Search and Destroy matches. Today, uh, this was a hell of a game for me. It was probably my best game of all time on Black Ops. Uh, let me know if you guys have topped it. Uh, 21 and 2 in a Search and Destroy match. Pretty fucking solid if you ask me. Uh, I managed to accumulate over 10,000 points in the game, which is hard to do. I've never done it before. I've been meaning to commentate this match for a while, but I just haven't gotten around to it because uh, I hate commentating while my family is home. It, it's so fucking awkward. I'm sorry. It's I like to just be myself while I'm alone. No homo. But, um, yeah. Today, Black Ops... Search and Destroy, uh, using the AK-74U with rapid fire. If you notice, I barely ever aim down the iron sights because it's literally, it's not necessary. It's really not. You don't even have to fucking aim to kill kids in this game because it's so, it's so new friendly. Look at that. Fucking dead accurate with this shit. Put steady aim on and you're golden. You're, you're fucking golden. Uh, yeah, I'm using AK-74U with rapid fire, as I said. I am managed to give this guy a look. I'm using ballistic knife on backup. Uh, lightweight, pro, steady aim pro, and marathon pro. Uh, kill streaks, RC car, care package, and attack helicopter. I shouldn't have used care package because I, I honestly hate care package. I usually use napalm strike, but this map is kind of kind of congested, so there's a lot of buildings, and they can just hide in the buildings really easily. So and nobody's usually running down the middle, so there's no point in using a napalm strike. Uh, yeah, a lot of people requested a search and destroy match by uh, for me, so I, I had to get one. I was very picky when it came down to it, though, because. I didn't want to get a normal gameplay. I wanted to get a fucking nasty gameplay. I, I did. I did go try hard on this game. You can say that. Like, if you put that in the comments, like, "Oh, dude, you're such a fucking try hard." Yeah, I know. At this game, I did kind of go try hard, but you know what? If you want to get that footage, if you want to be happy with that that gameplay, then uh, sometimes you just got to do what you got to do. And again, with the steady aim bullshit, I fucking I. If you catch me in a game, if you if you like play against me or play with me, if you notice, uh, if you're spectating me, I literally never aim down the, the sights because, in in my opinion, iron sights are just another thing to get in your way of killing the the enemy. If they're far away, yeah, I can see I can see a fucking point, but when you're close up, maybe mid range, you can spray kids down and you can be confident where the bullets are gonna go and shit. See, look at this, watch this. I bet you any money I'm just gonna pop up and fucking own this kid. Oh, oh, never mind. But, this is my first time watching the gameplay as well, so... Count how many times I uh, actually aimed down the sight in this gameplay as well. Oh, this one. So... Yeah, um... Black Ops. Uh, I'm getting kind of tired of it already. It It's sad to say, but I'm getting kind of tired. Uh, there's too many prestiges. 15 prestiges? Oh my god. Fucking insane. I, I think I'm a fifth prestige. I'm getting tired already. And I honestly don't... I, I, I keep asking kids in games how there's there are a prestige higher than me because I got the game 10 days early. I started playing online four days before the game came out and I'm only a fifth prestige. How the fuck do people manage to pull this shit off? Because... I'm completely oblivious. I'm baffled by how much time they've spent on this game, and I'm like dedicated to this game a lot of my time. And they they managed to beat me when it comes down to prestiges and shit. But yeah, you know, there's too many prestiges in my opinion. But you know what? You can't really do anything about it. So uh, right here, I fast forwarded because there was it was all bullshit. More bullshit. And, I, I I think I died too, which was kind of sad. It restarted my kill streaks though, so that's all good. Um, 
What else? Oh, KD. My KD right now is a 2.15. For a search and destroy player, that's pretty damn good. I, I managed to go. Uh, I say my rec, uh, my usual KD is 12 and 3. My my kill death is usually 12 and 3, 12 and 2. Around there. Whenever I play with my friends, they're always like, "Oh shit, dude, he's so good," and stuff like that. Whatever. I'm not trying to brag, but when you play this game that much, uh, I would expect you to go like 12 and 3. Um, oh yeah, the AK-74U really overpowered. Kind of random, but it, it's so fucking overpowered, but. It's a solid gun. I, I like the gun from COD 4. I loved it in COD 4. It was fucking awesome. And I guess they just... They gave it some steroids and fucking... Popped it in Black Ops. Because it's legit... Dirty. It's the best. It's the best gun in the game. Um... Uh, I have another gameplay that I was going to commentate, but I don't know if I really want to. Uh, I checked out how long it was. It was over an hour long, which is basically pathetic. It was a demolition game, and that's usually out of my my interest because I, I fucking hate demolition. My, my friends ended up convincing me to play demolition because I, I was getting bored of Search and Destroy, and... My friends don't usually like to play Search and Destroy because you know, the fact that you don't respawn. Um, a lot of, lot, of, lot of campers, if, if you want to call it that, because I don't know. They they wanted me to play Search and Destroy. I mean Demolition. Sorry about that. And uh, I played Demolition. I played on Nuketown. We kept playing on Nuketown. Nuketown. I, I love that little like that streak that always happens once you get Nuketown. They, everybody wants to play Nuketown again. It's like a fucking virus. Um, yeah, we were playing Nuketown, and I was using the... A, a, I, I don't want to say AK-74U, but I think it might have been. Could have been the uh, the AK-47. And I, I managed to go 150 and 40. Legit, probably one of the dirtiest games I've had. I, I was going to commentate it, but the, the fact that it was an hour long was... It just kind of didn't. I didn't really want to bother with it. Too much footage and not enough shit to talk about. Right here, I died for the last time, but we had, we managed to win the game. So, in a, in a matter of six rounds, I got I went twenty one and two. So that's pretty fucking ill. Uh, if you guys can manage to beat that score with a what is it, ten thousand five hundred points? Please, uh, put in the comments your best game. If you have footage as well to go with it, put it as a video response. Let me know, because I'm curious. I, I've never seen a score like that, so peace out, y'all.